The guitar has been perfect for me because it's really given me this opportunity to practice and learn and explore that nothing else has. For as long as I can remember, I've had this insatiable desire to create and grow. Guitar for me was kind of a happy accident. I was at a music store one day and I just looked at a guitar and I was like, that has strings. <laughs> like, I like strings. <laughs> and so I started playing it and I just, I don't know, I, I really took to it. I found metal because it was fast <laughs> and demanding. I, I really like, I was like, this is my thing. This is, this is what I was supposed to do. This makes sense. I really struggled to communicate when I was younger. Guitar opened me up to be able to relate and connect with the people around me. It was also the first thing that really came naturally to me. For me and my guitar playing, I feel like I approach a lot of things in a bit of a different way. Don't be afraid to like break out of your, your comfort zone and, and don't be intimidated by doing something that you think is really challenging. In this course, I'm obviously going to be teaching a lot of tapping techniques because that's what I love to do. I really want to open up the average guitar player, doesn't matter what your skill level is, to trying new things and challenging themselves, you know, help them grow creatively and in their writing. So by the end of this course, I really want you to have a fresh perspective on guitar, something you haven't tried before, maybe new ways to practice or implement techniques, even if you're already familiar with them. It's only when you push your limits that you begin to grow. I'm still scared to do what I do. I think doubt is sort of an inevitable part of being a creative. You're really opening yourself up and being super vulnerable by putting your art into the world. You're gonna be accepting a lot of criticism and that can be super discouraging. But that's also what makes it so beautiful because despite all of the, the doubts and the criticism and the negativity that goes with expressing your art, People are still creating and they're still putting it out there for others to see and interact with. It's a way to reach out and communicate with the world around you. Learning how to communicate makes life easier and learning to communicate through your art makes life more enjoyable. I'm Sarah Longfield. Come tap with me at jamplay.com.